Well, good morning. We're taking a look from Southeast Community College off to the east. Sunrise is just about to happen officially at 647 or about another well, probably 30, 40 seconds from now from the official sunrise time. Uh, we are losing three minutes of daylight today and we're going to lose two more minutes tomorrow. Taking a live look now from P Penner Bathing Solutions in Aurora and you can see we've got mostly clear skies overhead, just a few clouds out and that's about it. We've got 67 degrees in Lincoln. It is 66 right now in Aurora, a bit warmer up in Columbus where it's 70 degrees and with clear skies to the south, temperature sitting in the low to mid 60s. There are some scattered showers around the area. Now you're seeing this green here. That's just some false echoes showing up on the radar. There are some thunderstorms up near the Omaha area. Also some showers back up to the north and northeast of Grand Island and some showers out towards Greeley. We're also watching a few showers moving into Lancaster County. These through passed through Seward just a little while ago. Uh, these are west of the airport at this point, so along I-80 you may have to turn on your windshield wipers once in a while. And a few showers off of the north and east up towards Waverly, and these will probably clip the western and southwest side of Lincoln here within the next 10 to 20 minutes. These will keep moving off to the south and east, so we'll keep a chance for an isolated or scattered shower in the forecast through the morning and probably up through right around noon. After that time, I think we'll start to see our skies brightening. We'll see our skies turning partly cloudy for a while before another round of some clouds move back in as we head in towards the evening. Temperature wise, I think we should make it up into the upper 80s. There is a chance we could make or we could hit 90 degrees today in Lincoln. I'm not going to go that high just yet, but 89 in Lincoln. We could hit 92 in Beatrice, Fairbury, 91 degrees in Hebron, 88 for high today in Seward, and 88 degrees today in York, and 88 degrees as well in Columbus. This evening, clear skies, or I should say partly cloudy skies, uh, 82 degrees by 8, 80 by 9. We'll be in the 70s by 10 and 11. Overnight, our temperatures are going to drop back down in the lower to mid 60s. Leave the windows closed. So I think it's going to be just a little too warm uh, to leave the uh, windows open. Now, a warm front is going to slide through here on Friday afternoon. Uh, that's going to bring in another chance for some isolated showers, probably Friday morning. Uh, we'll have a lot of clouds through the day, and I think probably football games are fine Friday evening. But this warm front is going to bring in a more humid air mass that will slide through the area on Saturday. So we're going to notice the humidity picking up on Saturday. Our winds will increase. Our temperature should be up right around 90 degrees, even with some clouds around, and there will be a chance for scattered showers as we go through the day. Those will likely continue into Sunday morning, and I think right now Sunday afternoon looks to be dry with some sunshine breaking out. A high of 90 degrees Friday, 90 Saturday, and 90 degrees on Sunday. We dry out after that as we end we round out August, we'll see temperatures in the mid 80s and as we start September, we'll see our temperatures hanging out right around 84 to 85 degrees, which is about where we should be for that time of year.